Very Hello. good to see good you. Morning. Hello. Good and who have you brought you. in you. with you? Fifi. This is Fifi. Say good morning. What sort of dog is Fifi? She's a Coton de Tillier. Is she She's indeed? A French dog. Oh, 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 that might be bad news this morning. <laughs> she, she, <laughs> she was is... born in the UK. Oh, well, oh, there you, there you go. There you go. Absolutely beautiful, and she's got quite a beautiful tail on her. Yeah, so it'll be interesting tail. to see what way it wags. But have you heard the, of this before? That dogs wag their tail in absolutely. a certain way. Absolutely, um, it's dog body language. So just like human body language, dogs have their own body language. The tail is a really interesting one because, and the research shows that you know they're tending to wag their tail to their right means they're using their left brain activity. And left brain activity is where the emotional... It's all emotional and happiness. And um, if they, their tail goes to the right, it shows you that they're happy. But is that now, in all of this, there may be people concerned are going, but I love my dog and my dog seems to love me. Sure. But, but it's not wagging in the right direction. <laughs> they should be worried. Shouldn't they be worried? Well, I don't think they should be worried. I think every dog has its wag. It's almost like a strut. So like a human might have a strut the way they walk, every dog has a unique wag. Yes, they do. And then they, they sometimes wiggle wag, so they wiggle their bottom and wag. Mm. And every owner has probably seen their dog when they come home, very happy to see them, so they wag their tail at reunions, but they also wag their tail at arousement or excitement. So, for example, two dogs in the park, they both see each other, they both put their tails up in the air. Does that mean they're friends and they're really happy? No. But what they're doing is they're signalling each other with their tails. The dog who's wagging their tail to the right is sending unfriendly signals. The oh. dog who's wagging their tail and it's straight up might be saying, I don't like you signals. Mm. And it's those signals which allow them to either go and say hello or not. Oh. As we were reasoning this earlier, that, uh, I mean, a, a tail is another limb for them, really, exactly. isn't it? Exactly, it's an expression. I mean, horses, when they're angry, wish their tail around, yes. unless there's flies, of course. But, yeah, it's body language, and you can tell a lot not just by their tail, but by their face, by their eyes, by their expression. They can say, I'm stressed, I'm happy. But a good owner... Yes. Presumably can read their dog. If they're, if they're a, a good, Absol loving owner. Absolutely, and, you know... When you actually stroke dogs and you touch and you get into that dog zone, you're reducing your heart rate, you're mm. reducing oh, your yes, blood good pressure. For and, dog, and dog owners know their dogs very well because actually for the dog, their owner is like the Truman Show. Mm. So they're watching their owner continuously. All the time. All never the take time. their eyes off you. We'll never, never miss a stroke. Oh, she is so gorgeous. We've got some videos of different wags. Um, and we weren't quite sure whether or not, whether, whether they're wagging to the right or the left or just going round and round and round. Should we have a, have a look at this? This is my little dog, Ellie. And that's her, no, her, dog, her wag is, is going either side. Perfectly it's normal. Going, yeah, it's going either side and you can clearly see like it's a happy wag, isn't but it? But if you slow it's... it down, now look, if you slow it down and you watch this wag, she changes the way she's wagging. It's going left to right at the moment, yeah. and then suddenly, at uh, some point around now, it starts to go around in circles. Oh, really? Look Helico at that. Like a helicopter. Oh. Yes. Exactly. Now, what does that mean? Ultimate happiness. <laughs> I love you so, so much. Is it really? Absolutely. It's like, literally, I love you so, so, so much. And, tail, and the tail's actually horizontal. It's not up in the air. Yeah. What we were talking about before with dogs' tails up in the air... Is, is different from tails which are horizontal. Mm. And then tails that go below show that dog might be tucked under the legs. Yes. Show that um, the dog might be anxious or worried or scared. So you can tell so much by now, we, we've got another, meeting other dogs. We've got a bigger dog here with a sort of a longer tail. Um, and again... A, oh, well, no, the, no this that. is the little one. No, <laughs> She's entirely horizontal, isn't she? Exactly. Just an so equi, happy. equi, whatever. Almost going into helicopter again. Yes, yes. Look at There that. are a lot of little fluffy dogs. Dogs there, love humans more than I could even ever tell Yes, you. don't they, just? Really? And they love show it by wagging so the tail. so much. Absolutely. I think we, we might have another video. Do we have one of a, of a larger dog? Oh, this is Aiden's brother's oh, This is brother Aiden's dog. brother's dog. Now, I think this is wagging to the right a little bit when, it, when he comes through. Uh, wagging to the left, rather. Oops, he slips on the kitchen floor and... He's wagging to his left a little bit, yeah. yeah. But that may just be and because it was a very he low know what's wag. going on. Yeah. 
But he's gone in, being a good uh, yeah. dog, he's gone into a perfect set for them there. Yeah, apparently well-trained. And I think we've got a cat. Oh, we've well, I don't think you can read anything from this. Oh, this oh, is this Timmy is last night. This, this is what Timmy garden. thought of the dogs. He thought of the dogs, that he'd just clean his bits. Well, yeah. um, so there you go. But I bet you can't tell me anything about him. No. <laughs> He's a very happy, contented cat, let me tell you. But it does make sense, as you said, because if we had a tail, and we all yes. know that once upon a time we probably did, um, if we had a tail, we would use it to do certain signals. We, we would use it, wouldn't we? Like we do hand signals. Yes. We, we talk with our hands. We talk with we? our hands a lot. So they're talking with their tail, we talk with our hands, it's much easier. If we didn't have hands, we might talk with our feet, but... Um, it's just body language, and it's their way to communicate with us. And it's a great way, if we understand that body language, it's a great way for us to understand. Mm. We all know when they're telling us that they're hungry and they want to be fed, they've got that please feed me face. Yes. Mm. And then they're sort of please stroke me face. And when they turn on their tummy, please stroke my tummy face. And, you know, all they really want is, you know, a bit of they attention. They just want, yes. They want to give you love, love and have love back, don't they? Yeah, and, they, I mean, they know. do talk to us animals, don't they? Abs and this is the bottom absolutely. line. Absolutely. But they don't speak English, Japanese, French, Russian. They, no. they speak dog. So this study was done in, in um, China. Yes. But it's presumed that uh, Chinese dogs use their tails to... to well, it was a language it was just a really the same as ours. interesting art. study because they Express. took these beagles and they introduced them to the same person for five minutes over consecutive days. And each time that the dog met the person on a second and third occasion... They wagged their tail more and more and more and more to the Aww. right. And they used a 3D scanning technique, and that's how they got these 21,000 wags for their um, Oh, she's just study. so beautiful. What's her name? Fifi. 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 I'm sorry. I do this every time we have a dog in the studio. And I'm, and I, and I, and I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a cat person, really, but I just can't. I love animals. I just love she's animals. I can't help myself. It's amazing. Get her to look towards camera because her face is just so oh, gorgeous. Fee. Come on, feet. Look oh, to camera. Oh, look at that. And darling. what was her breed again? A coton de tillier. A coton de tillier. A, A coton, coton de tillier. Yeah. 